Welcome parents, family, friends, and GDK Tigers. Everybody give everybody a hand. You are STEM Students of the Month, and we are so proud of you for the month of November. We are so happy and excited that you are all here to join us today as we celebrate our Tigers who have demonstrated the STEM trait of the month innovative students. Way to go! Today I'd like to introduce some of the people who make this event possible. Our school theme, oh wait, let me, let me introduce everyone. We have Ms. Tumanella right here. She organizes virtually everything. She makes sure I sign all the certificates and then put them away in order. Right, Ms. Tumanella? I can't miss anything with her. Also, we have all of our guidance counselors. We have Ms. Knowles over here, Ms. Kay, Ms. Wunderly, and Ms. Bell. Woo! We have Mr. Bone, Ms. Barone, and Ms. Hastings, and Mr. Bugs, who aren't actually here. They're doing field trips. Ms. Barone and Ms. Barone. Are you here, Ms. Barone? No. And Ms. Hastings and and Mr. Bugs, they're getting ready for a field trip right now, so sorry we missed them. So thank you everyone for organizing this wonderful event. It's wonderful, I love it every month. Our school theme is helping everyone reach our goals. Oh, and I forgot Mr. Weaver. Woo! We couldn't do it without him. He posted the videos, posts, just all our tech. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And also Ms. Schultz. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Our school theme is helping everyone reach our goals, the acronym for which is HERO, because we believe that everyone in the school community is a hero. We have decided to use this theme in conjunction with the STEM traits. Each trait is represented by a superhero who exemplifies the STEM trait. I bet you can't guess who the hero is this one. Iron Man, that's right. November STEM trait of the month is innovative and it's represented on the student certificates by the superhero known as Iron Man. Tony Stark's innovative thinking and creativity combined to create the famous Iron Man suit. With each prototype, his innovation continues to evolve and enhance his powers. Iron Man is the perfect superhero to represent our STEM train of innovative because he, pro he proves that with knowledge, innovation is endless. Today we honor these tigers who have demonstrated their ability to think beyond the norm, just like the superhero Iron Iron Man. Thank you, tigers, for being the models of innovative thinking in your classrooms and within the school community. I'd like to welcome Mr. Bone to the stage to MC. Okay, not Mr. Bone, Miss Wonderly! That was supposed to be just in case Miss Wonderly was at a meeting today, which got canceled. All right, good morning. So everyone, with the way that this works is we're going to call you by grade levels. And Ms. Kay and Ms. Knowles help you get up on stage and get organized. You have two slips of paper. You had one attached to your chair and you had another one that was loose. I need you to bring the one that was loose with you so that I make sure I read what your teacher wrote about you in order. Um, you're going to line up here and then we're going to have a chance to take pictures. Of course, as you walk across, you're going to shake everybody's hand, get your certificate and the magnet that everybody loves. And you're going to take a picture at the end when we have all of the grade level and then Ms. Servone and Ms. Bell help you kind of get off the stage. Now, we have a different twist this morning because we usually start with pre-K, but this morning we're going to start with sixth grade because they are leaving right away to go to nature's classroom, which is a great field trip. So let me have the sixth graders stand. And Ms. Knowles and Ms. K are going to help you get up on stage.
All right, starting off our sixth graders, we have Maddie. Maddie constantly comes up with innovative ways to help others and problem solve with academic and procedural issues. Alan is creative and innovative young man that enjoys bringing new ideas to our classroom, always stands out for his creative thinking during our class discussion. And if we can hold our applause till we recognize everyone, Julian is a creative thinker who always seeks new and efficient ways to solve problems. Thank you, Julian, for always thinking outside the box. Derek was engaged and excited about creating his structure for our STEMtober activity last month. He is able to create useful tools using unconventional resources. Jackson is a great student. He looks at problems and uses innovative ways to find solutions. He always gives his best effort. Great job, Jackson. Kaylee is nominated for Student of the Month in Homeroom 427 because she is a hard-working, on-target sixth-grade student. She's always willing to assist and is very innovative in her approach to problem-solving. She always has a smile to share and uses kind words with everyone. Necessity is the mother of invention comes to mind when thinking of Kareem. He has learned over the years how to be creative in solving problems such as repairing ripped backpacks with a stapler or using a paper clip to replace the broken hook on a lanyard. In addition, he is always eager to share his creative problem solving inventions with others. Akash always finds a way to relate the content to something that is relative to his life. He's very enthusiastic about learning and it shows in his ability to think outside the box. And these are our sixth grade STEM students of the month. So sixth grade parents, if you are here, you may come closer for a picture at this time. I know you're here. I tell you it's okay to take that picture. Okay, now sixth graders, you're going to go down the stage and we are going to let you get your treat. Ms. Scholl and Ms. Bell are going to help you with that. And then you can go ahead and head back to your classroom. Enjoy your field trip today. All right, now we're going to look at our screen case, students. This is Caroline. She likes to be the teacher in the library and read books to children from our classroom. She's very imaginative in our housekeeping center, leading students into imaginative play. She also likes to sing and dance. We enjoy having her in our classroom. This is Madeline. Madeline comes to school each day ready to create. She starts with an idea and follows it through to the end. She loves exploring and working with her peers. And this is Arlen. Arlen is a sweet and charismatic little girl. She loves to try new things and is learning to express her creativity more in the classroom. She especially loves participating in pretend play during center time. She has a lot of energy that she enjoys sharing with others. She likes to learn and takes pride in her accomplishment. And these are our pre-K students. Feel free to come close for a picture. Kindergarten, if you would stand and look to Miss Kay, she's going to help you get up on stage.
Okay, here come our kindergartners. Let's remember our manners. Listen close to what their teacher said about them. This is Aubrey. Aubrey brings her innovative skills to solve problems when she is collaborating with her peers. She has wonderful ideas of how to get something done and is also able to vocalize her concepts to help friends. Shreyans is a great example of someone who is innovative. He's a creative thinker who is always willing to introduce new ideas with his peers. Michael often thinks outside of the box and comes up with ways to answer questions in both reading and math. They're often impressed with what Michael comes up with. Way to go, Michael. And this is Chloe. Chloe is very creative and comes up with lots of innovative solutions in class and new games to play at recess. Solar is very innovative in class. He likes to try new ways of building structures with Legos and blocks. He thinks of creative ways to come up with improvements so that his buildings will not fall. He always tries to think of different ways to help his friends out if they have a problem. Victoria combines unique ideas of her own in a variety of innovative ways when completing her classwork and monthly projects. She's a creative thinker who applies unique ideas and techniques to her learning. Elaine is a wonderful example of an innovative student. She is a critical thinker and an excellent collaborator with her peers. She's a valuable member of our classroom community. Nikita is our STEM student of the month because she's very innovative. She loves to figure out ways to problem solve and is always original with her thoughts and ideas. She loves participating in class and I enjoy hearing her reasoning. Elliot is full of new ideas and expresses them to our class. He is extremely creative in his thinking and helps us all think outside the box a little more. I'm proud to nominate for our most innovative student. Kaki is a very innovative student. She is also she's so creative and also likes to bring new ideas to the table. She is always creating new things, including necklaces and headbands for the teacher. And these are our kindergarten students of the month. <laughs> kindergarten parents, you may come closer for a picture at this time. And first grade, stand and look to Miss Knowles. She is going to help you get up on stage. activities during PE class. Jacob thinks outside the box to create unique ideas. He works to solve problems with critical thinking. He is innovative in daily tasks. Ezra shows innovation both in and out of the classroom. He has created several projects that have shown creativity and critical thinking in order to find a better solution to problems. Lucas is always thinking of new ways to do things and solve problems in our class. He's always suggesting new ways to use tools and materials in innovative ways. Bella is always thinking of ways to solve problems and coming up with creative solutions. She is also a math whiz and an all-around awesome tiger. Matul uses different ideas to create things in class. He is able to come up with a variety of solutions to different tasks and activities. 
John is very creative and innovative. He is motivated to do his best to be creative, innovative, and collaborative. He always goes above and beyond his innovation. His innovative style encourages his classmates to give their best effort as well. Cruz is a great kid who shows initiative, follows directions, and is a role model for his class. He also demonstrates knowledge and creativity when participating in strategic game situations. Jeremy is a very bright student and is always trying to problem solve and find a solution in a creative way. Zarin is a very creative student. He is always thinking of new ideas, helping others to solve problems, and creating interesting pictures. Dacacia is always asking, wondering, questioning, and using critical thinking. She loves finding a new way to solve problems. Varenshi is a very innovative student. He has unique ideas and creative ways of solving problems. He thinks outside of the box and has a lot of knowledge to share. Jocelyn always shares new and fresh ideas in class. Her creativity combined with her thoughtfulness inspire others in the class to think about things differently. And these are our first grade students in class. first grade parents you may come closer at this time for a picture second graders please look to Ms. Knowles and Ms. K they're going to help you get up on stage ways to figure things out. He shares his ideas with others. Olivia loves a challenge. She is fierce and competitive in the very best way. She embraces all of the second grade enrichment products, projects, including the September pencil challenge when she designed a beautiful flower vase out of unsharpened pencils. She thinks critically about problems in the classroom, on the playground, and in the cafeteria. Frankie often has creative solutions to problems. He is always ready to add his own insight to class projects, presentations, and also offers these ideas to other students. We all value his input and ideas. Josiah is always keeping us on our toes. He finds a way to make everything creatively. Our class loves to see what he has created and how it is to work for our benefit. Jonathan, well, you think of an innovative student and his name automatically comes to mind. No matter the subject, he always has a unique perspective or idea. He loves solving problems in a way that most students would not think of, and he also finds the most innovative ways to complete tasks and projects. Naya demonstrated innovation during the second grade DASH competition. Her skills in designing, building, and coding the DASH robot pathway led her team to success. Her classmates and teachers enjoy her innovative ideas. Gabriel is always thinking outside the box and looking at tasks and problems in new and innovative ways. His creativity shines through with everything that he does. Taylor is a quick thinker who can work through problems using a variety of strategies. She helps others solve problems by offering suggestions and supporting their ideas. Abdel Roman has been nominated by two teachers. 
He is a very innovative thinker. He has great ideas and comes up with ways to solve problems efficiently. He consistently thinks outside the box and loves to share and participate in class. Molly, you are always a step ahead and willing to help out and be there to help your fellow students and to help me. You are always looking for ways to make things better and finding solutions to any problem. I am thrilled that you are in my class. Guillermo is our class nominee for November STEM Student of the Month. He shows that he is innovative by being an independent thinker and problem solver. He's willing to try new things and think outside the box. Adrian is a creative thinker who often finds new ways of completing tasks, solving problems, and achieving goals. And these are our second grade students of the month. Second grade parents, feel free to come closer for a picture at this time. And third grade, if you would stand and look to Miss Knowles and Miss Kay, they're going to help you get up on stage. <laughs> All right, here comes third grade. An innovative student is one who consistently thinks outside the box, and Jaden is always someone who has a fresh outlook on old ideas. Our STEM Student of the Month for Innovation is Sean. He always contributes to discussions with new ideas and insights. He thinks outside the box and has a quiet confidence about him. Sheridan always has new ideas. She thinks outside the box during science challenges and even shares new ways of figuring out division problems during math. Braden always surprises us with his out-of-the-box thinking. He consistently finds new solutions to problems and is willing to put in the work to meet expectations. Caleb is always making us say, cool. His way of thinking is very outside of the box and his ideas are innovative. Malini is able to take a simple idea and nurture it so that it can become something grander than imaginable. She thinks about concepts in unique ways and stops at nothing in order to produce what she envisions. Samantha truly is an innovative student. She is a great thinker and problem solver. She will always find an answer to a problem some way, somehow. She never gives up. She, she does all this while being respectful, polite, and kind to her peers and adults. Diego is always, always, always coming up with ideas to create something, problem solve, and even create created a book to help our class with a difficult topic. Look out world, we have an innovator here. Destiny is a great example of innovation. She finds answers no matter how difficult the problem. She is a deep thinker and is always thinking of a new and better way to solve anything that comes her way. Josie was a part of our group that won the Innovative STEM project for creating a superhero that conserves energy. She was a great team player and brought lots of ideas to the table. And these are our third grade students of mine. Third grade parents, feel free to come closer for a picture at this time. 
in fourth grade stand and look to Ms. Knowles and Ms. Kenny for directions to get on stage. Starting us off in fourth grade, we have Isabel. She is an innovative inspiration to all students. She is constantly reading and exploring new ideas. She has created wonderful stories with illustrations, and best of all, she shares all of this with the class. Mahi has been nominated as our STEM student of the month for innovation because he has new methods for solving math questions and is always more than willing to share them with his peers. Chloe showed great innovation during the fourth grade pumpkin chunkin competition. Great job, Chloe. Fiona is a very creative student. If you are feeling bored, check with Fiona. She always has a fun and innovative idea going on. Cole is constantly looking for new and effective ways to solve problems with his classmates, both in and out of the classroom. Always looking for alternative ways to solve problems, Evan uses his creative mind to tackle the most challenging of concepts. He thinks critically and presents new ideas to enhance his learning. Drishti is a wonderful thinker who always seems to be focused on inspiring, exciting, and encouraging imagination and abstract thinking. She is currently working on making a movie clip to show a creative approach to a slam book she has read. She is open-minded and following her own path. Sandy uses her innovative thinking consistently throughout her school day. She uses mathematical reasoning and art to showcase her logic and proof for math word problems. Her creative talents in ELA have brought life to her projects and she sets the bar high for other students to achieve their very best. Karitza is an innovative leader in and out of the classroom. She is not afraid to use technology and the tools around her to try new things. She is constantly open to learning new things and applying her new knowledge to adapt or change thoughts, concepts, and ideas. When thinking of a student who possesses innovative qualities, Daniel's name immediately comes to mind. Not only does he know about the latest apps to use in the classroom, but he also has ingenious ideas when it comes to academic work. And these are our fourth grade students in life. Okay, fourth grade parents, go ahead and come closer for a picture at this time. And fifth graders, if you would stand and look to Ms. K and Ms. Knowles, they're going to help you get up on stage.
right, I hear a fan club already for our first student. Our first student in fifth grade is Jacob. Jacob has been innovative and creative during our warm-up exercises for physical education class. He has modified exercises that have adapted to his needs. Way to go, Jacob. From a classmate said this about Tyler. I think Tyler should be STEM student of the month because he's independent and doesn't need anyone to tell him what to do. He is proactive and synergizes when he works with other people. He has innovative questions and lots of thoughts and new ideas. So we think he should be STEM student of the month for November. Mackenzie is very quick to come up with new and original ideas. Whenever she works with a group, she tends to be the idea starter. There is no doubt that she will continue to be creative and independent thinker. Roman is always innovating in class for creating new trends to find ways to solve problems. He is very innovative. Braden is super creative. He is a great innovator who uses initiative and creativity when participating in physical education. He is a super creative kid who is a great role model for his peers. Arnav has displayed a great deal of innovation in his artwork. He comes up with very interesting ideas that he incorporates into his creations. We enjoy seeing him through it all, as well as hearing his explanation of it. Hunter is always creating ideas. He and another student won the fifth grade marble poster competition. He works well with others to problem solve and design classroom projects. Muaf shows innovation through his problem-solving science skill, his skills in science. For Steptober, he came up with an excellent idea for a new ride at Bush Gardens. He incorporated elements that kids enjoy, speed and competition, into his ride. It was his innovativeness at its finest. Ryan demonstrates innovation daily in the classroom. He is always coming up with creative new ideas to complete classroom tasks. He incorporates technology and shares his creations with his classmates. Rama is a creative thinker whose innovative ideas contributed to her team being named the winner of the fifth grade structure competition. Her contributions to class discussions elevate our conversations and challenge others to think about concepts in new ways. Damien exhibits new ideas and original ideas in classwork across all subject areas. His creative, and his creative thinking and innovative ideas are in his student of the month for November. And these are our fifth grade students. Okay, fifth grade parents come closer at this time to get a picture. And seventh grade, if you would stand, because we already did sixth grade. So seventh grade, if you would stand and look to Miss Knowles, she's going to help you get up on stage.
So Justice is back for a third appearance at Student of the Month. He is creative, original, unexpected, inventive, and Justice can be depended on to deliver all of this and more. He's the real innovation package. Samora, this student has shown innovation in class by making connections of new content to her prior knowledge. Her connections are always interesting and out of the ordinary. This is Carter. Carter is one of the most innovative students in the history of New Tampa. He is always creating new and exciting ways to entertain the masses. It's never a dull moment when Carter is around. This is Anthony. Anthony represents the STEM character of the month, innovative, because he is creative in his thoughts and actions. He thinks of new ways to accomplish activities for himself and peers. Brian is an asset to our class. He uses his creativity and knowledge to come up with great solutions to problems. And more importantly, he learns constantly and readily, applies that new knowledge to new problems along the way. Tanner is very creative and has confidence that shows when asked to step outside of his comfort zone, he actively participates and is always eager to share his knowledge. Sienna never ceases to amaze us. She is always outgoing, willing to work with others, such a positive attitude and innovative. I could go on and on. I am so happy to have Sienna and Abbott where we work hard and we play hard. Sierra is certainly innovative. She introduces new ideas to the class, consistently participates in bringing in innovation and different perspectives to class discussions and projects. Faith always exceeds expectations when asked to be original and creative doing any activity in class. She is also very organized and polite. She is a joy to have in homeroom and first period. Paige is a creative individual who continuously exhibits this through her many out-of-the-box answers. Her detailed explanations both entertain and show a wonderful side of creativity. She looks through the world in a different view that allows herself the ability to show off her artistic and original viewpoints. And these are our seventh grade students of the month. All right, seventh grade parents, I know you're out there, so you just tell them this wonderfully said I could come close to get a picture. And eighth grade, if you would stand and look to Miss Norman, she's going to help you get up on stage. Now on to 8th grade. That's what happens when you don't listen to the principal. 
Serena's going to start us off with eighth grade. Serena is my go-to girl for innovation. She has a very creative mind that helps me to see different ways to approach topics in class. Yon thinks outside of the box to figure out ways to solve problems. He was the first eighth grade robotics student to solve the second autonomous sensor challenge. Michaela has been quite clever in thinking outside the box while approaching projects in class, taking time to put extra effort into going beyond old-fashioned paper and pencil responses. Her use of technology and integrating it with what we do in class makes her work very innovative. Dante is always looking for ways to make things better. Without hesitation, he will ask if there's anything that needs to be cleaned or fixed. He is a great team player and helps solve any problem. Max is always curious and asks questions on how he can make something better. He pushes boundaries to create solutions and challenge the norm. Veronica has shown great initiative and innovation while planning for Hero's Journey Story, from sketching out drafts to recreating visuals from print stories read in class. She is a leader of innovation by showing others that success can be attained from having a different point of view. Daniel is an excellent student in that he is always trying to look for new ways to solve or think through problems. Specifically in geometry, he finds patterns and or creates formulas for shortcuts to solve intricate problems. Andrew is receiving this award for demonstrating innovation, specifically by consistently being eager to try new things and investigations in the science classroom, as innovation is the hallmark of all scientific learning. Kayla is a wonderful student and a positive role model. She is very, she is very quiet, but goes about completing her tasks in various ways. She is always looking for better ways to get the end results. Pierre has the most incredible imagination and lives in a, a world of pure joy and possibility. He is quick to find a solution to any problem and offer a fresh idea. Kaden serves as, my, as Ms. Howard's student assistant every morning during first period. The class is a seventh grade ESOL class and, and the teacher is constantly finding new innovative ways to effectively relay content to them. Cadence consistently brainstorms with the teacher and sometimes even leads small groups and ensures that those students leave class with an understanding of the concept. Drake is a motivated student, always willing to try new things. He is creative in his ways of thinking and inventive with problem solving. And these are our eighth grade students of mine. All right, eighth grade parents, if you're there, don't be shy. Come on closer and get that picture. but today I'm going to start off with our leadership. <laughs> Just to be a little different. And of course it's in like, you know, five font, and I'm old, so of course i got to hold it out here. No, no, I'm just kidding. I can do that. 
our um, leadership team is extremely strong and there's one person that puts all of this together and she is an amazing, amazing leader, Miss um, Tuminella. She is the first thing that comes to mind when we reflect on innovative practices at TBK8. In her role as STEM coordinator, she leads the faculty in growing their own professional practices and encourages our teachers to take risks in order to prepare engaging lessons for our students. Whether it be coordinating our STEMtober day to planning family STEM nights, Ms. Tuminella thinks, out, thinks outside the box and is the driving force behind several programs at TBK8 that sets us apart from other schools. We are honored to have Ms. Tuminella as a member of our leadership team, and we know that Turner Bartels is capable of great things with an innovative mindset like the one she possesses. Thank you, Ms. Tuminella, for all of your efforts in leading, leading our staff, students, and school into greatness. Next, I would like to recognize our middle school um, teacher of the month, Ms. Howard. Ms. Howard is innovative in her approach to teaching language arts and working with students. She presents her content in new and challenging ways, including getting into character for her students. She encourages students to think outside the box and serves as a role model to all of our students, but especially our middle school girls. She has started a Girls in STEM Club, which is providing our young ladies with this opportunity to see their own potential in the STEM fields. She is also encouraging our girls to show their inner beauty with the Natural in November initiative. Thank you, Ms. Howard, for cons consistently seeking new and innovative ways to engage your students. <laughs> Next, we'd like to recognize Ms. Powell. Innovative teachers think outside of the box and strive to implement new and improved ideas. Ms. Powell has demonstrated the desire to do so for quite some time. She pushes herself to grow professionally, which has provided her with the necessary tools required to make change. She consistently presents her students with alternate methods for learning content, including implementing the We Do Robotics program. Ms. Powell shares her knowledge with her team and encourages their own use of innovative practices through the planning process. Thank you, Mrs. Powell, for creating innovative learning opportunities for our students. And last but not least, Ms. Harrell. From various creative activities using the Clear Touch interactive panel to plan planning collaborative experiences for her kindergarten students to work excuse me, with fifth grade on Kane, Ar Kane's Arcade, Ms. Harrell's classroom is a hub of innovative ideas. Ms. Harrell is often found pushing her students to work outside the box and provides them with an environment where taking risks is a common way of work. Thank you, Ms. Harrell, for being a role model of innovation. so proud to have such wonderful teachers here at TBK8 and thank you for all you do every day.